Hey guys, still here. Welcome back to ICBM. In this second part of the East, no, not East Asia, the Pacific Naval Strategy, it's time to actually start dealing some damage. So far, I have been able to dominate the Eastern Seaboard of East Asia, and I have also been doing the same on the Western Seaboard of the US. I used to be friends with South America. Used to. Because then they turned on me and they were able to er eradicate <laughs> they were able to eradicate a couple of cruisers the cruisers which were defending canberra and sydney fortunately sydney uh, if my carrier would just happily get out of the way my sydney is still relatively okay um my plan right now in this episode is to start engaging the larger cities in east asia Making sure that East Asia does not have the capability to attack me anymore. Um, US, so North America, down to 80%, which means that their production capability has already been impacted. South America is at 94. I am concerned about South America. So I have constructed a couple of 10 megaton bombs, and I am eager to use those. So we're going to arm a couple of the bombers with those. And uh, I'm going to wait until... I know whether there are any SAM sites, and if I find them, that they'll be destroyed. Uh, once that is done, I'm then going to attack Lima and Bogota, because they are very large cities. And they do contribute quite a lot to the production capabilities of West, uh, sorry, uh, South America. <clears throat> For now, though, it is time to hit... Uh, where are we? No. Where am I hitting? No, no, just East Asia. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to be hitting Tokyo, which contributes 18% to the GDP of East Asia. And it looks like everything is focused on hitting that. So we're going to execute Plan Alpha. Plan. One bomber is snoozing. It just took off. We have a South American bomber over here. And that's going to hit Sydney. Oh, Could we kindly Ship intercept sunk. that bomber, please? Thank you. Ship sunk. Destroyer lost. Destroyer destroyed. Not there. Not here. Oh! A West Asian carrier group might have something to do with that. <clears throat> as well as... Yeah, I also lost a cruiser four seconds earlier. That was the group that was off the coast of Tokyo. Now, these two bombers are going to be intersecting uh, with sunk. Tokyo in... 54 seconds. Holy shit, that was a big hit on Jakarta. Ship the sunk. problem... Another destroyer gets killed off. Where? Not here. The problem with the naval strategy is that I am reliant upon these naval assets. And I'm reliant on them a bit more than I would actually like. <coughs> to some extent. I also have very, very little in the sense of strategic strike assets. Oh, I think it might have been this. No. I don't know where I lost the DD. I don't like it. East Asia, 92. Let's reduce that a bit more. <coughs> Since East Asia has been hit constantly by ships, it's going to be proving to be pretty difficult for them to do any kind of defense Research against these strikes. AOAX is complete. That means I can now send out my helicopter. Oh, that's too far away. Fine. We're going to have to send out that carrier unescorted. Not a big fan, but here we go. It's going to go unescorted. <coughs> that's pretty bad news. Shanghai is next. GDP 14%. I am back on the map at 124 points. East Asia is down to 80%. I have, however, lost 9% of my population so far. Let's get another one of these bombers ready, and then a few more bombs. The bombs are immediately mounted onto the aircraft, and the bombers are immediately out to hit Beijing. Unfortunately, the destroyer slash cruisers that were... Oh, Shanghai. Uh, the guys that were over here are not quite capable of dealing with any kind of planes, since they're dead. So ideally, the cruiser is going to have to take up the slack. Um, let's set up a few.
few more DDs first. <clears throat> East Asia. Down to 75. Seoul's gonna be next. Shanghai. And then Beijing. Seoul's now down to 6.07. I'm still at 91. East Asia. <clears throat> I'm gonna drop, knock them down to about 60. Shanghai hit, Canberra hit, Sydney hit. Yep. I'm not exactly sure where they're coming from, though. There is something that's flying in from the south, so... Potentially from South America? And if not there, then from Russia. Flying over the north slash south pole. Now, we can potentially already start wiping out some of these installations as we see them. Let's have the group move directly south. <coughs> Pollution's at 32, so I still have plenty of time to deal some more damage. Whoa, that was Mexico City. Another destroyer's ready. Let's hit that radar site make sure they got no warning. Now, I have a, an AWACS asset over here. Might as well use it. Where would I like that destroyer? Uh, House East Asia? 62. Okay, they're going to get one more nuke, and then I'm calling it. That'll be enough. Mm -hmm. A couple more tens. Hold on, where's that... Damn it. Research complete. I don't like that one bit. I'm starting to take a few too many hits over here on my ships. That's courtesy of these anti-ship missiles that are being launched by the attack bombers. I don't like that at all. Join that cruiser. Activate your space radar. I think we've waited long enough. We're gonna go on the defense or on the offensive. Hold on, hold on, hold on. How's East Asia? 62. Yeah, we still need to hit him. Sorry, Tokyo. East Asia's 59. Cancel plan. Tokyo just got hit again. East Asia 59. All right. Oh, damn, this cruiser got hit. Turn back. What the hell hit you? Aha. We have found the culprits. Kill it before it lays eggs. Oh, it's laying eggs again. Uh, hold. Hold. Cruiser, stay. Stay, 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 stay. Intercept it. Damn it, the cruiser's gone. Those anti-ship missiles are getting pretty damn potent. And more importantly, I can't spot them yet, unless I send out my AWACS. Get your butt over here, I need your radar assistance. Now, how are we doing over here? Because Lima looks ripe for the taking. We have five bombers standing by. I want you to uh, move to here. I'm gonna send out two units over there. Shit, Melbourne just got hit again. They do have anti-ballistic missile weapons, but I'm not sure if they're actually using them properly. How's my population? 80. Shit. South America's down to, to just 94. Oh, hello, Nuke. Is that gonna go to Lima? No. Another destroyer got lost? 
It'd be ideal if the game would actually tell me where the hell that's going on. Alright, you're gonna go to Lima. You're also gonna go to Lima. I'm putting these things over here instead of going directly for Lima, because when they do that, they're likely to get intercepted, and I don't want that to happen. Whoa! I'm not the first one to hit Lima, am I? But Lima got hit with a relatively small bomb there. My bombs are bigger, buddy. Oh shit, it's a point of no return. Oh no. That means that those bombers... Did you even drop? You didn't, did you? Hold on. I'm gonna have to call these guys back and make sure that there actually is a way for them to get home. So I'll first have to get rid of these air bases before I go on the offensive. Uh, new strike plan. Asset, air base, target, city, South America, ready. We're currently not ready yet because none of our aircraft are currently at home. We do have another one ready. Right there. Can I actually make that? Hmm. Maybe. Maybe just. No! They can't make it! Oh no. It's point of no return, so they only have a one-way trip. They can still hit targets in East Asia. Executing Fine, strike. we'll hit East Asia again. <clears throat> Hopefully they won't pose too much of a threat. We got a bomber over there and a bomber over here. Those are both South American bombers. And I want you to target that airbase. I want to make sure that those aircraft don't have any place to return to. Gone. Next one over there. These cruisers are fantastic weapons when you have them upgraded. Go on. See, that gets intercepted. Those SAM sites are doing a hell of a job keeping Buenos Aires safe. Good for them. Not so good for me. If I park an airbase a little Ship further sunk. to the east in Auckland, that might help. Ship sunk. Where the hell am I losing ships? Here. It's that damn carrier group. That's turning into the problem. And I don't really have any good way of dealing with it. Uh, unless I send my AWACS and start loading up the bombers with anti-ship missiles. That might be the way out. Alright, we're gonna have to attack another airbase. Gone. Several North South American bombers are flying towards the north. As long as that's their destination, I'm perfectly fine with it. The moment they come after me, I'm in trouble. Alright. I hope that this is also going to negate any kind of attack that the South Americans can do against my cities. Because I think that Melbourne and Canberra and Sydney kept getting attacked by bombers coming out of East... Oh, sorry, South America. Uh, this carry... Oh, shit! Crap. I want you over here. So that we can spot a lot more. Uh, deal with this site. Deal with that one. Oh, that gets intercepted, huh? That one doesn't. That one doesn't. That one doesn't. Okay. Alright, this bird bit more. I think I can also hit this one. No, that's too far. Just out of range. Okay. Mm. I can load these up with nuclear bombs, but those are the standard ones. Not terribly deadly. 
Research complete. Lovely. Uh, I'm gonna go full production for a bit. <clears throat> I don't feel like I need much research. I just need to strike. Because right now my points are not that great. 621. I've lost 23%. Uh, East Asia is probably a hell of a lot worse off. They're down to 48. And uh, I'm constantly hitting those. Although that is turning into a pretty risky venture at this point. Because of that carrier group over there. So it's time to equip these guys with anti-ship missiles. Make a new strike plan. And send that to deal with the East Asian aircraft carrier. So I want the airbase to attack the carrier, the destroyer and the cruiser. There's this plan, right? Yes. Shit, it's a West Asian carrier. It's not East Asia, it's West Asia. What the hell is West Asia even doing covering those ships? Or not the city, the, the, not the ships, but the cities. Nuclear threat detected. Lovely. Uh, no. Where? Oh, here. Goodbye, Manila. A city has been bombed. Ow. That was another 4%. Execute, Execute plan Upsilon. <clears throat> Let's get rid of those ships. It's going to take me a bit of time, but at least I have good information. Oh shit, they're about to intercept that AWACS. Get out! Get the hell out. New airbase in one minute. Once that airbase is ready, I'm still going to go after the cities over here. And I'm going to have to make my way a bit further south to make sure I can hit that airbase. That might be the culprit that kept striking me. I hope... Oof. Ship sunk. Damn it. That carrier is doing a bit too much work there. I don't like that one bit. Uh, next order of business. Bombs, bombs, bombs. Keep going. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. There you go. Came at the expense of a few aircraft. But that navy is no more. All right, I'm expecting that this Auckland Air Base is able to hit East, no, South, why do I keep calling it East, Af East America or East, whatever. Uh, South America target that check. But the problem lies in that we have no bombs at the moment. Submarine. Not an attack range yet. Keep going. Are you serious? No, now we can hit him. Two to Lima. One to Arcaibo. One to Santiago. One to Buenos. Oh shit, they're not armed? Crap. Cancel all. Hit with the megatons. Thank you. Try again. Two to Santiago. Two to Buenos Aires. Production one to complete. Lima. Production done. Um, we have 12... No, 13 and a half minutes. I cannot build a nuke silo. I think bombs are my best option right now. So let's keep going 10... Keep growing? Keep building 10 megaton bombs. Now this airbase is in range, and now I can take it out. Gotcha. Alright, I would recommend that you stay a little bit away from Santiago. Because that place is about to be a whole lot worse. We're down to 66 on the Pacific. South America. 89% population. Well, that's about to change. Um, Santiago, hit. They're down to 84 now. This is going to be a big one. Down to 75. 
Lima is also a big city. There's another bomber going out from here. Allow air patrol. They're down to 72. Unfortunately, that does seem to sort of be the extent of my range. Point of no return. Understood. Lima is not that interesting. No. It is. It just doesn't do that much damage if I go at it with an attack bomber from this aircraft carrier. That's the problem. Um... I still have bombs. Let's see. East Asia cities. Executing strike plan. I'm not sure why they're not actually going after anything. High point. Beijing. Chongjing. Uh anything else valuable? Oh, Osaka. Somewhat. My score is slowly going back up. 741. And South America is getting knocked down a peg. They're down to 68%. Europe is at 61. Production complete. I believe they're still my ally at this point. Silo is in four minutes. I can maybe get four strikes out of a silo, if that. What about an airbase? Ten minutes. No, it's going to take me too much time. Can this base hit the US? Well, maybe, but the aircraft are already underway. Ooh, I can just about hit the US. Time to go after Los Angeles then. Go. Buenos Aires just got hit. Santiago still has a population of 2.47 million. 1.26. Buenos hit again. Down to 1 million. Their population is now 57%. I'm down to 61. I think the SSBN strategy worked a bit better. Hold on a moment. Would you like to educate me on what the hell that is? And more importantly, why the hell you have one? Because I didn't order that airbase. And I don't like it being there. Uh, attack. One, two, three. There you go. Airbase gone. Next target. Sam sites. Oh, they're just out of range. Make your way towards uh, Arequipa. Santiago hit again. Five minutes left. I think we're going to run into time limit earlier than we are into pollution limit this time around. Much. Right, yeah, there we go. Oh, really? A city has been yeah. bombed. Where? Ho Chi Minh City. From Russia. With love, I imagine. That's debatable, though. Sam site, one minute. Yeah, let's go over a couple. What are my largest cities here? Uh oh. Do something. Do something more. That was three anti-ballistic missiles coming out of three destroyers, but everything either missed or was just not enough to kill off that ICBM. And I'm now down to 53. <laughs> not good. Uh, there's the point of no return for those aircraft. The Auckland ones might have a better chance. The thing is that these cities are getting, well, less valuable. I should get rid of this thing. Nice work. And that one. 
What is still big enough to defend here? Okay, some sites are gone. There's still a lonely submarine out there. Got an airbase all the way out there, but that's a bit... Well, actually... No, I can hit that. Good lord, these cruisers. Production complete. Production done, alright. Let's protect our population a bit more. I won't be able to complete all of those, but every bit helps. 1.24, 3.21, defend Jakarta. And Palembang. We still have some nukes. We still have some targets. There. From here, we still have a couple of bombers on standby. Uh, I wonder what Lima is going to do. Up to 21, okay. Time to finish 149. That's probably the last flight of those bombers. 134. It's going to be pretty close. I won't get to the score of West Asia. They got a lot of population and did a lot of damage. And they still have a ton of defenses. Although that's something I might be able to change. One minute five. I wonder what happens when I strike Delhi directly. Incoming nuke. Target. Bombay? Bombay. Go on. Attack Delhi. We're 10.9. Nobody gives a shit. Okay. So those weapons are fantastic if you want to knock out any kind of defenses or assets like air bases and missile silos. Not so good for dealing with anything that is a city. The hell you are. I'm not even sure if that was aimed at me or not, but I'm not taking any chances. Are the SAM sites ready? At this point, it doesn't matter. There's 12 seconds left on this game. Missile out. <laughs> West Asia is getting knocked down a few with SAM sites, and that allows Delhi to get hit. All right. Score, mm, 1179 versus West Asia with 2011. Africa got very, very much in trouble. 1148 negative. This is also of interest. East Asia. Zero killed. Not a single thing. They didn't have, or they didn't drop any nuke. I'll give you one guess as to why that is. That is really interesting. So the strategy works. It just works. Um. Oh. Okay, I'm not exactly sure as to why we're back on the map, but I guess we just got reset 90 seconds or something. Anyway, um, as I was saying, the naval strategy does seem to work because I was able to knock out a lot of East Asian defenses. They kept building SAM sites. I kept knocking them down with the cruisers and that just cycled. And they it kept the AI so busy that they were just unable to either defend themselves or to go on the offensive. Any airbase that got built got killed off. Uh, I'm not even sure if they ever built missile silos. But once the nukes started flying, it got even worse for them. Because with the nukes on the way and no defenses, they started losing population. When you lose population, you lose production and research. So with that tactic of having a couple of destroyers and cruisers scattered around their seaboard, they were just not able to build up anything, and that means that they got no kills. It's not as bad as Africa. Africa really lost a lot of population. They lost 92%. Then again, I'm not even sure if they were still... Yeah, see, they were in a coalition, but they were not sharing tech. This makes so much of a difference. So important. Because it just gives you a technological advantage, and a big one at that. 
Now, that was it for the naval strategy. You can try it out for yourself by using the link down below in the description to play the demo. The demo will be live from uh, today through, I believe, October 13th. And that's when you can play it for free. The game will come out later this year, 2020. And when exactly that is, I don't know. But if you like the game, then please put it on your wish list and have a look at it again when it comes out. Thank you for watching. Let me know if you have any strategy that you want like me to try out for the next one, if you're not trying it out for yourself already. And I'll see you guys soon for another ICBM video.